Is there anything you wish that your children's teachers or administrators at their schools knew about communicating with you? I make sure they communicate with me. <laughs> Good answer. I make sure. It just takes one email. <laughs> I like it. And press send. Okay. I want to get just very, very briefly into, uh, you've talked a little bit about um, the value of teaching babies to sign very early. And can you tell us a little bit more about that? Well, people think that if you teach a child to sign, deaf or not, that you're going to prevent them from learning how to speak. So I wanted to put that out there right now, that first of all, signing is visual and absolutely visual. So it has, I mean, you could teach signs like more, all done, happy, milk, uh, it's very easy to, for a kid to pick up from zero to five. It, their brains are like sponges, we all know that. But this notion that uh, it prevents them from speaking, thinking that sign language is gonna prevent kids from speaking is, is not the case at all. It's, it's a language and kids need language and one language will not preclude another language. It, it, it has been proven that learning sign language is advantageous to a child's development. And speaking will happen at any time. It does not prevent speaking. Okay. You are a very passionate advocate for equity in this, this era. That takes a lot of guts and it takes leadership. What are some of the lessons you can share with our members about facing your fear, facing your detractors, stupid boyfriends, <laughs> uh, as you mentioned earlier, just or even the power of failing and keeping going. Own yourself. Own. Listen to yourself. Make sure you take into consideration what other people say, but make sure you go with your gut and make sure you, if it's something regardless of whether you want or uh, incorporate into one's life, communication is key. Because if you don't open up and communicate, if you stay silent, if you're withdrawn, you won't get anywhere. And if you see someone like that, if you see someone who doesn't feel like they can communicate, that they're withdrawn, that they're not engaging, then jump in and lend them a hand and then go from there. I like that. It's a helping approach. I appreciate that. Yeah. Is there anything that you would want to say to kids right now, specifically maybe? Uh, Life is bigger than you realize, <laughs> uh, particularly after high school. Your mom and dad will be there to hold your hand as much as they might be when you're younger. But understand that you have time to make decisions, you have time to gain your independence. You have time to to do and be and who, whatever it is that you want to be. Just make sure that school is on the list of priorities of things you have to complete. Be patient. Absorb everything that you can, and do the best that you can. And then once you get up for all that, and you get into college, the world is your oyster, and you, you, it's very exciting and intimidating, but that's okay. <laughs> All right, last question for today. What is the one thing you hope everyone walked out of this conference after hearing you speak that they will remember that they're gonna take with them? I hope they remember that I'm living proof that uh, being fearless for life is important. Uh, I hope that I inspired them to inspire their children. I don't know what to say. Say that again? I, you didn't, hear you. I didn't hear you. She didn't know. She doesn't trust that I said the right thing. <laughs> 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 Did you say Cassidy? Yeah. No. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> you can hear it. Right. I'm putting him at the spot. I see. <laughs> well, you guys have been together for like 30 years? Is that right? 33 years. 33 years. 
So you're just besties at this point. Besties, yeah. And and everything she said is not what she said. I just made that. <laughs> <laughs> I believe you. I'll keep that in mind. So you now I have to look it up. <laughs> well, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you, you so much. Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. It was great talking to you today.